And hello from one of the great venues in world football, the San Siro in the city of Milan. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. I'm greatly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. It's Milan, and they take on Bologna. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And Milan's lineup looks like this. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Davide Calabria plays with Theo Hernandez in the wide defensive areas. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. And this is the lineup for Bologna. Well, it looks like they're going to play in a 3 4 3 formation without wing backs, which means the outside centre halves will need to cover the areas out wide, which I would say is asking a lot. A potentially fascinating 90 minutes ahead of us, and Milan get the ball rolling. And they know they need to stop him. Kessier. Brahim. Oh, terrific pass. And a goal! Just what the fans wanted to see. The ideal way to begin. Well, I'm sure the replay will confirm he got a touch on this, which he does. So he'd be really upset that he didn't keep it out. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Brahim. Well, he's given us away. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Soriano. Nicolas Dominguez. And he's made headway. Well, it would have been a chance, but the run was mistimed. Offside. Kessier. Now Giroud. Has eyes for goal. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. And over comes the corner. Superb block. Cleared away comprehensively. Roberto Soriano. 
Well, there to intercept. Rafael Leao. Keeping possession of the ball. Surely he's gone and found the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Well, a second goal for them here. Hickey. Arnautovic. Using his strength to shield the ball. Svanberg. Sends it back. Well, he hit it with authority. Close. Well, Milan are controlling the possession, as you can see, and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Promising sequence. And space for the cross. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Corner conceded, it came off the defender. Now sending it in. It hasn't come to very much. Diaz. This looks interesting. Determined block. It's a short corner. Deciding to go inside. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. Well, his name and number have been taken as well, Stuart. And quite rightly so. It was a poor challenge. He was right to give a penalty to the referee. And he's right to give the yellow card. Well, here it is again, and what a penalty this is. Right into that top corner. There's no saving that one. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. In behind for him to chase. Well, a bad pass it was. Brahim. Well, approaching half-time on the home side. Very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Well, when they play like this, they're such a good team to watch. Their passing, movement and finishing have been of the highest quality. 
if they continue to play at this pace for the rest of the game, who knows how many they could score. Well, unable to bend his run offside. Giroud. Diaz. Credit to them for winning back possession. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Will they profit from this situation? And an example of a counter attack that went nowhere. Teo Hernandez. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Mastery of the passing game. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Can they get in behind them? Nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. The first half here comes to an end. Whatever way you slice it, it really has been a positive contribution from midfield, Stuart. Well, Derek, I have to say, he has been a joy to watch today. You just want the ball to go to him. Some of his passing has been brilliant, and of course he's created a goal. Magnificent performance. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Perfect example of how to execute a slide tackle. Going well. Sandro Tonali. It's with Giroud. Kessier. Terrific block. Giroud. Hickey. Musa Barro. Marko Arnautovic with it. And a pass that lacks quality. Kessier. Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Brahim. Kessier has it. A bit sloppy in possession. Arnautovic breaking at pace. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Chance to finish! Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. So back underway at 3-1. 30 minutes to go, then. Given away by Milan. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. And he read it well. It's a perfect challenge. Sandro Tonali mm. 
and he saw the situation developing. How about the cross? Could be dangerous. Terrific defending to stop them progressing. Kessie. It's with Diaz. Sandro Tonali. Well, they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. They've got it now. What can they do? Soriano. It might be on for them. Now well, possibilities in the centre. De Silvestri. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. And the referee will go back now to the earlier incident. Yellow card it is. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Played in there. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Ten minutes left for play. Tomori. Well, you can absolutely sense the frustration growing in the opposition camp. They can't get near the ball. Brahim. Kessie has it. Zero! And a fantastic diving save. And over comes the corner. No spillage from the goalkeeper. Routine. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. Who can they pick out? It's not a particularly good corner there. Rebic. Kessier has it. They've regained possession. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Teo Hernandez. Ante Rebic has it. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Alexis Salamakers. Well, they might be onto something. Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. And the short option preferred. And so the referee blows the whistle. That is the end of the game. And Milan victorious. What did you think of their performance all told?
Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority in attack, Stuart. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal, and they won the game. An excellent day all round.